wagwan me youtube family welcome back to another video so in today's video we're gonna walk you through our regular sunday nothing is in order because you know say on a sunday you do things in pieces you know say you pressure the peas there so you make the meat go and soak right there so you did look about drinks right there so so we're just going to show you how we do it on a regular sunday so today we are look about some oxtail rice and peas we do look of vegetable and some irish potato and sweet potato pasta so sit back don't forget to subscribe if you're new and you haven't yet done so and just hit the thumbs up button as soon as you enter and start watching so here we have two pound of oxtail and for me personally i like to clean my oxtail or wash it whichever one you want to say with some vinegar or lime juice and what i'm doing here is to cut off the excess fat from the oxtail because i don't like that right so that's what i'm doing here just removing the excess fat from the oxtail so we're just gonna go ahead and continue to do this until it is completed for every pieces of the oxtail wanna see how the oxtail look nice Yes, when me buy my oxtail at the meat shop, I love my oxtail chop so. See how the slices them even? Right, so that's how I like my slices. I don't like when you buy the oxtail. You see the big old bone at the meat like you have to take a piece of chop and try to cut the bone. Because them bone they're tough, you know, guys. Them bone they can't crack so easy, you know. So, me like when I go to the meat shop, I get them perfect slice there. Because them easy for cook and it can just pressure right through so you can chew up the bone and everything when you're ready to eat. So I have here some bean that 
that I've been soaking from early this morning, about 6 this morning, and it's now 9 o'clock. So what I'm about to do is to put it in here and allow it to pressure. Just put it in here and allow it to pressure. So on the breakfast side, we have some real Jamaican style chocolate tea or cocoa tea or whatever you want to call it. Yes, that same tea that would help on top. Mm -hmm. That's what we're going to make for the tea. So with tea done well, we are straining it off and we are going to serve wake up. I'll have a video posted on how to make this cocoa or chocolate tea recipe soon maybe i'll post it on wednesday so i have this video uploaded so you can check it out on wednesday so this is our tea here steam arise and everything so that we are gonna have right there so and we're gonna have some food with this so we're gonna have some banana and some sweet potato and uh, yes so that's that for the breakfast section now we're going over to preparing the salad and the pasta with a little vegetable bowl and with pasta pan side yes so we have some tomatoes salad cucumbers and the sweet potato and we have in the dish sweet potato and irish potato so we mince our scallion our green onions and we're adding it to the boil sweet potato and irish potato right guys man i've shown off about sweet potato and irish potato i am assuming that everybody know how to do that right so i'm just gonna show you how to make my sweet sweet pot sweet and irish potato pasta what i'm about to do is to mince the scallion the tomato and the sweet pepper small in small piece so you chop them fine you mince them and i'm gonna add it to the ball sweet and Irish potato bowl. All right, guys, so the oxtail finished marinade. So what we went ahead and do is to pour oil in the pot and then we're going to fry them until they're golden brown on both sides. Once you achieve that base on your liking, we're going to go ahead and then add the meat to the pressure. So that's what I like to do. Fry them first, then I add it to the pressure. All right, guys, so while the ox tail is going to cook there so we just going to continue to make the salad so this is a realistic sunday morning guys in the caribbean or in jamaica other countries can speak in the comment section this is how i do it on a sunday other persons jamaican can comment down below and tell me if that's what you guys do too so you do one thing you multitask in the kitchen you yeah, do multiple things at a time so you leave something there on the stove while you're doing something else so you multitask straight through in the kitchen so we finish make with pasta and this is it delicious irish potato and sweet potato pasta with some vegetables guys you have to try this i had a link in the top right corner because this was already a video that we have done before so we're moving over to the salad bowl so we have here cucumber one of my favorite vegetable and we have a salad we are also going to add some lettuce so 
it this is us pretty simple all we're going to do is just to chop the cucumber and thin slices as well as the salad and we're going to mince or chop we're gonna chop the lettuce but you could leave the lettuce as is but this is how i prefer to do my vegetable just take a look okay guys so we're going to now pressure the ox steel right so after you fry you put it to the pressure we're going to add it for 20 minutes and then we allow it to pressure all right guys so while the ox steel are pressure and with vegetable finish and the pasta already finished as well and we'll put everything in the refrigerator for go and chill we just have a look about the rice and peas now so we have the peas there that is already pressured and we had the coconut milk powder now we're going to wash the rice and then season the pot add with pepper add with green onions or scallion add with thyme and then now we're going to put the rice into the pot allow everything to boil up and then we'll make it go and simmer down just i'm gonna make this kelly and the thyme and the pepper just go and boil up for about one to two minutes to get all of the flavor there in the rice and pea i'll have the links in the top right corner guys because everything that we're doing here there is a separate video to everything in detail so you can just click on the cards in the top right corner and you can see the full videos for everything the rice and peas how to cook the oxtail how to make the Irish potato and sweet potato pasta all of that have a separate videos for themselves
what we're serving with today's meal is some sorrel with some red label wine and some rare navy white overproof rum in there so this is how the rice is looking after it is finished so we're moving on to the final lap we're gonna now make the oxtail go and simmer down and get all of that body there so it don't cook and it fuck tender so just go transfer it to one pan whatever pan of your choice you have in your kitchen then we are going to add with baked bean turn the flame to medium and allow it to simmer down add your little ketchup and let that sauce thicken you know say everybody love oxtail gravy and love to lick off on a 10 big finger them if i tend to have and this is our final presentation with our sorrel drink we have a vegetable over there so we have a sweet and irish potato pasta right there we have a lettuce and a salad with a nice clean good up good up oxtail i do hope you enjoy this video guys my mouth does run water so and this is a realistic sunday morning preparation for our dinner and we have a period this and this on my plate now guys you know so may i use eat spoon you know what with them say about people love eat with spoon comment down below and tell me how that go guys this was a very delicious meal i hope you guys enjoy the multitasking in the kitchen with chef t so it was just chef t for today don't forget to hit that thumbs up button guys bye